Welcome back, y'all. We're going to do a money read, okay? We're going to look, do a collective read in regards to finances. So let's see what this month is going to bring in for money, okay? Money. Let's see. I'm going to start off with this deck here. Oh, so this just jumped out. We got thoughts, okay? And it's sudden wealth. All right. So a lot of y'all got money on y'all mind. Some of y'all done got some money, okay? So that's, I'm getting money on, on your mind, okay? So let's see. What else? Concern. Yeah, it's, it's a, I'm getting messages of concern. Some of y'all might be getting a phone call from somebody who could possibly be in jail, in prison, could be locked up, okay? I'm just putting that out there. Some of y'all may be concerned. This is mental prison, too. This is a mental prison. Like, this just could be something that's on your mind. This person, you're not, a lot, all of y'all aren't dealing with somebody who is incarcerated. But I feel like this is just something that's heavy on your mind. Like, you got that money on your mind a lot. How are you going to, how are you going to, you know, manage your money? Okay? You're trying to make something official. We got official person here. And I feel like I feel like some of y'all getting ready to get a message from from somebody, okay, about some money, okay, about some money. Some of y'all, this has to do with child support or something that has something to do with alimony or something in concerns where maybe you have to go to court about it, okay. And it's definitely about some money, okay. Somebody. Somebody uh, could be getting ready to get some money, getting taken out their check. Okay, I'm just saying, and it's, it looks like a male. It looks like a male is getting ready to get some money taken out. I feel like it could be for child support. Some of y'all getting ready to get uh, some type of notification, or some may have to go to court about child support or something in concerns to that. But I'm getting like, y'all getting ready to come up on some money. Money that's old. Someone could be going to jail for not paying child support. All right, let's get into it. Yep. All right. Y'all are, I feel like it. Seven of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles. Y'all waiting for some type of money to hit. A card, your debit card, a check in the mail. Okay, I'm getting like y'all, y'all are waiting on that. Okay, y'all are waiting to hear some type of news about money. I'm getting somebody telling somebody that they love them. Okay, somebody's like, I love you, I love you, I love you. Somebody is telling somebody that, okay? But the thing about it is, is I feel like it's being forced. I'm going to put that out there because we got the seven of wands here. The seven of wands here is definitely kind of pushing, kind of forceful type of energy. This is like pushing something, pushing something through, all right? And I feel like you knew. You have a, you have this idea. You are very intuitive. You have this feeling that this person is saying that because they want something from you, Okay? This person over here, they walked away. They're doing something away from, at a distance from you. And you feel kind of like overwhelmed. You don't want to overwhelm yourself. So some of y'all, mm -mm, ten of swords, y'all ending this conversation with this person. I'm hearing ending the call. Okay, ending the call. Ending a call. Yep, the world. That's closures. Yep. And a chariot. Yep. See, y'all letting this go because the situation toxic. This person is super duper codependent on you in some way, shape, or form. They only come around when they want something. Okay. And I feel like y'all, mm -mm. mm -mm. y'all been holding on to this person. This is somebody 
y'all been holding on to this person for a while. And this person is all of a sudden telling y'all that they love you and they want this and they want that and how much how much they care and it's like, mm, why now? Yep, you're not sure if it's really love or not. You're not sure what's really going on. You're not sure. I told you. Justice. Some of y'all dealing with somebody that's in jail. That's what I feel like. Or could possibly be going to jail. I feel like going ahead, you're going to feel like this person's going to be mad as hell because they oh, they going to end up owing, owing you. Okay? Somebody could end up owing you some type of money. Could be a king of wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. You knew this person was gonna reach out to you. You knew it. Your intuition was telling you that this was this person was gonna reach out to you. But this person been MIA. It's like they've been running away from responsibility. You ain't even been able to really even keep in contact with this person. And they left. They could have left for another uh, situation. But for some of you, I'm getting child support. Now they starting to worry. Now they start, they starting to worry. Because they're looking at their money. Their money is leaving them. Their money is going down the drain in some way, shape, or form. Their money is low. Yeah. For some of you, this is a baby father. You feel like this person has not been a help at all with that five of pentacles they ain't been no type of help yep yep could be a sagittarius yeah you just don't feel like it's a good decision you feel like it's just a bad decision to try to hold on to this situation. Okay, I feel like this situation has already is not gonna work. Okay. I feel like you put in the effort before, but it was like for what? When this tower hit and this three of pit, it's like, mm, mm it ain't gonna work. Okay. I'm getting a lot of frustration. I'm getting this person been pissing you off lately. This person been pissing you off lately. And it's because I feel like this person owes you some type of money. Okay? And I feel like you've been looking out for this person. You've been looking out for them, looking out for them, looking out for them. And then they call you out of the blue all of a sudden. They want to talk. And it's like, now you want to talk. It's too late now. It's above me now. It's above me now. It's above me. <laughs> it is way above but, I mean, for some of you, like I said, I saw the empress right there and the emperor. For some of you, this is a baby mother, baby father situation. For some of you, this is a husband and wife situation. It could be a boyfriend, girlfriend situation. Whatever the case may be, this person is now wanting to reach out to you. And you knew this person was coming. Coming to ask you for, for something. Coming to ask you for something. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I'm going to chat with y'all later.